Basically, Vanson went into the archive collection and pulled this asymmetrical style jacket and pretty much applied Crooks graphics. Fitted it to myself, gave it the whole blackout, you know, thugged out look. And the result's pretty dope, man. Like, the jacket fits really good on the bike, on and off the bike. It's the kind of thing that you can pretty much use functionally and also to go into a bar or a club, wherever you're going, you know, off the bike and still look dope. It's just a cool jacket, lifestyle-wise. I'm in a city and everyone's like, hey, let's just go out for a minute, you know, let's go hit the canyons. And I got this on, I'm like, I don't have to go home and go change. It could withstand a slide, because of the thick hide that Vanson uses. So in the event of like you low siding or something, which happens mostly in the city, you'll be all right. Got the crazy custom art by Crooks and Castles lining. Definitely has enough room for a back protector. I think it'll reach a pretty good, you know, broad market. The biker guys want to have something cool that they can ride around with and also step off the bike and still not look like a Power Ranger, you know, kind of like blend in with the rest of the, you know, their friends that don't ride. And also the guys that don't ride but want to have that look of being a biker, it's a perfect jacket.